Hello there everybody, Amber here with another mod, which is probably one of my favorite um, mods, maybe, yeah, I think it is my favorite, this or the furniture store, which I have yet to review, it is my mock arcade, so, uh, brick built up there, I have the words arcade, before I made them too big, and I, I could just spell arcade, yeah, it ended right there, with no E, but then, um, you know, I was like, oh, maybe the brand's name is arcade, and that's just their style, but, then I decided I was being lazy and I added that E. But anyway, we got some details up here. On the A, we have a bike kind of crashing down on you. <clears throat> Sorry, I have a cold if my voice is a bit off, but there we have a little um, handle. Uh, a joystick, I think, maybe. Uh, a little arcade machine, a steering wheel, a gun, and uh, something from a claw machine. So uh, anyway, uh, the way this works out is uh, the roof doesn't lift out, which is the first time I did this where it's bricks all around and then there's a little inning for your hand it's kinda hard, uh, there we go and that thing just fell off but let's move that out of the way and get a good look at the kinda interior starting um, with the door okay so uh, again um, I forgot to mention about the exterior I have this striped blue slash gray design and that was mainly because of uh, lack of parts as with all my other mocks. That's why you don't see any mocks that are just kind of base color. The um, plate is uh, it's, um, the length of half a base plate, I believe. So the door says open 24 seven. And instead of using a stud like usual, I used a plate, one by one plate. And with the roof off, you can see how much light is in there and you can kind of actually see the inside. None of the walls um, removed as, it's, uh, as with the clothes store, though you can get in. And these are what hold the roof up but you can easily remove those and yeah let's enter through the door as figures would um so uh let's do that at the end actually um right here we have a dance uh, sort of kind of station i want to get a panel piece and maybe get a sticker but this is what it is right now little railing so no one interrupts all the colors that figures could jump and hop around to and that's the implemented screen here um we have a motorcycle uh, kind of feature where here's the screen and it actually goes in there a bit and it can articulate in two ways, forward and sideways because I use two of those kind of hinges, so yeah, forward and then sideways, so that is how that works and it's just a motorcycle and it seems like a pretty fun game. Uh, here we have a two-person shooter game, a hammer game, and that looks pretty good, you know, you can take the hammer, bang it, and then if it reaches the top, get a prize. Some more uh, arcade games, one with the joystick, one with the gun, one with another joystick that's bigger and a different color scheme. That I love, but I'll save that for last actually. Here's a racing game. You have a little um, kind of seat, steering wheel, and there's a council. So here is the prize counter when you leave if you have your tickets. So you have like the small prizes down here, guns for the boys, uh, boats for the girls, I assume and two glasses, uh, they also sell drinks here. That's like the credit card machine. And then you got all of those figures from like a board game back there. But uh, there's one thing I didn't mention yet, didn't forget, but just didn't mention. Um, all the arcade games do pull out by design. They're just like, <clears throat> again, I have a cold. They're just attached by like a stud or two. And this is a claw machine, so uh, be delicate with it. I remember this was really the hardest thing for me uh, to make and yeah it's also the hardest thing for me to take out so I need both hands so I'm gonna cut the camera I forgot to mention that the figures are not um, uh, official they're all custom I make with my own parts um not custom like that like uh, I take figures take them apart make new ones but um also they're not complete I still need to add more about this this is the single most complex thing I have ever made a claw machine the handle is separate probably wired on the interior but this <laughs> it's so great so you can see the claw in there <clears throat> sorry again um my cold but uh you have a lot of one by ones and circular and uh, studs and uh that's sort of the prizes you got the claw hanging in there and um i could only um the, i started this like after i got ninjago city by the way for a time frame and i got ninjago city when it was fairly new Mm, the summer that it came out so you got some lights up there and uh, I'm just so happy with, ha with how this turned out so I got one by two plates and then these cylinder plates coming up and then just a one by four um, 
and then one by one with studs at the side holding all this up and the, uh, just some studs in between and then these are more one by ones with stud at the side and be these are connected at the side so the studs are facing downwards and then the top studs I had with light and then the downward studs are actually holding this 2 by 4 plate and then uh, now I, it, it's all upside down building attached to the plate I have these uh, kind of transparent pieces and then to cap it all off I have a 2 by 4 and upside down so yeah again really 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 happy with how that um, kind of turned out so yeah as I was saying I really like that build and Here's it in case you wanted to see more. I really want to expand this and add like a bumper car area, maybe even a air hockey table. That would be cool. Using like the stamp pieces for the sort of, um, what are they called? I forgot. I know what the puck is called. Forgot the other thing, but yeah, um, let's get the roof back on and then I can show you it in my city. Okay, so as always, mock in one hand, uh, camera in the other hand, though this is fairly big maybe if I could help myself a bit right there the motorcycle fell off I could get that uh, later but this is its home in the mock not connected by any plates or tiles like it's not uh, like those buildings it's kind of on its own and you can see I have the little sidewalk uh, place in front of it and this little plant area back to a fair which is probably the next next uh, thing I still got to do a video on but yeah that is it for this mock and actually between the furniture store and this i think that this still might be uh, my favorite mock in my mock city that i've done sorry i'm just trying to connect the motorcycle but yeah that is it for this video i hope you liked it please subscribe leave a comment down below and i'll talk to you again soon bye